That was mad real, I guess. Probably. I mean, combo breaker was. I feel like the experience was real for those. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. It was. It was pretty hype. Speaking of which, now this is a real match. Let's go. <clears throat> so, bro, oh, tipper, like that? Yeah, and pivot too, man. These guys. I'm telling you, 2016. A lot of these marks are sharpening their punish game. Oh yeah, you know, we saw it especially with uh, Mr. Kevin Toy at uh, Apex last year. Really implementing a lot of those pivot X matches against Hungry Box into some guaranteed stuff. So. Oh yeah, and even the Moon versus Ooh. Drug Fox at Gamal. Oh yeah. Ooh. Okay. I like it. Yeah, that was actually I a like really it. aggressive edge guard. And that's what we were talking about um, prior with the uh, other match with um, the, the, the other players that were on stage. I can't oh, believe it. <laughs> with uh, Triple, Triple R and yeah, Duck. Yeah. yeah. The aggressive edge guards putting yourself out there. Sometimes that's what you're going to have to do to cut off the opponent from having the opportunity to even fathom grabbing the edge, you know? Whoa! I really like the patience from Eggie. Just sticking with normals. A lot of Peaches would have been kind of anxious to grab a turnip. He just keeps pressuring, but that time his hand was forced. Nothing he really do there. Uh, yeah, that there was quite accurate. But Eggy doesn't even look like he's unfazed. You know, he's, he's still going at it. Oh, it almost looks like he's reset, dude. It looks like he's edge guarding a spacey the way he was doing that. Oh, okay, bro. Pivot into just stand there. That's kind of intimidating. I'd be afraid. Yeah, that's one of those moments when you're just you're shook. Definitely, and you don't want you don't want to be shook, man. Oh, no. Because no. sooner or later your opponent is probably gonna cook you. Uh oh, you setting that situation just to keep getting that Martha off the stage, and that's a free nair. Oh, oh. no nair, no nair. Not even another F, uh, forward throw to reset the situation again. It's definitely a missed input. I was almost expecting a uh, <laughs> dare right there from Bro, but you know what? He's getting the damage sooner or later. He's going to be able to land one of his KO tools in neutral. It's a bit tough with Martha, right? Because you don't want to come in too hard. Oh, yeah. So anyway, moves that could KO like that. Yeah. If you were to miss that, he would have left himself open to punishment from Peach. Yep. Wave dash out of shield, maybe. Into, who knows, maybe a down smash. Could be trouble. Man, these dash dances, dude. He's so on point with this. I love it. All right, here we go. He has the two stock deficit, but he's still probably going to be. Yep, manages to come back anyway. And Good there too. Yeah, how's that going to land? There he goes. Finally, he had to come down with something, so he had to make a hard commitment. Ooh. Let's see. Fourth throw. I feel like he's going to make it. Yeah. Rose, Rose Dia has been on point all weekend. At the same time, you know, I like Iggy, uh really holding that top platform because holding that position is so important when someone's trying to recover. At the same time, you gotta be able to go out there, but that's game one. Yeah, man, Eggy. decisive. Eggy definitely couldn't get inside of Vro's defense right there. Vro just putting out those aerials really well. And like on the left side of the stage when you saw Eggy try to air dodge in, um, Vro had the right presence of mind to go with the neutral air, knowing right. how active it is, right? Right. So, Those are just the space it covers. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe even trying to catch an air dodge on the other side. I know that Eggy's been thinking that option a couple times. So. Ooh, and I, Eggy's gonna have to be careful while getting comboed uh, to try, attempt double jumping out, right? You know, Peach uh, with that double jump doesn't. Qu it's not as uh, quick, I'd say, when it comes to getting elevation. To start up. Yes, yeah. so, uh, in comparison to the other characters. Right. And because of that, you might still be caught in a combo and make it harder for yourself to recover too. Oh, sniped out the jump with the uh, dash attack. Almost got a pretty quick uh, low percent kill, but nothing. Yeah, hand was forced. Nothing really could do safely. I guess tried to predict the up tilt, just didn't get the right timing on it. Oh, and Vro just clanking right there with the affair. He ha he, kn he knows what he has to do in this matchup. He can't just let that turn up um, stop him from coming back on stage. Yeah, I think Eggy needs to be a bit more aggressive. You know, he's seeing that Vro is being very, very patient with uh, his time recovering. But, you know, he's not hes not finishing it. You know, he's getting these great situations with uh, Bro off stage, but he's just isn't able to complete it. Oh. And, okay, so the decision right there by Eggy, he, you know, noticing that since he's trying to get his feet back on the ground, right, he's going to have to go for some trades. Oh, he needed that most crucial. Good tap. Mm. Jeez. All right. Man. That's how you smash. <laughs> this guy. You know what's funny? I was thinking of your buddy Can I Smash when you said that. Don't talk about I, him. Oh man, he's probably watching. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Shout out to Steve. Nah. But we're back. <laughs> man and bro just keep it 
keep an eggy in the sky. He just oh! knows everything he wants to do. He senses a fear. He's going to hold his shield. I'm grabbing you. You're not ready to DI this. Hold this sword. Please, take this. <sighs> See? Mm. Sour spot dash? Mm. Oh. Bro, calm down, B. Calm down, man. And, like, Eggy didn't even have to jump left, so I was... <laughs> I was really scared for the man. Okay. Eggy DIing up. It's not trying to get caught by the can combo possibly. Mm. But, geez, and there it is. That's a quick 2-0 right there, bro. No emotion. All about his business. He's like, Sunglasses right. still on. Right? I never took my sunglasses off for this. Only reason why I'm wearing these sunglasses right now is because I'm the bright one. I'm the one that's shining. Ooh. And he's in top eight right now, mind you. So, so far, top eight winner semis. Who we got?